And so I think that we as a civilization are stupider and easier to spin. If we had better tools for remembering what we know, we might actually be able to advance our civilization a bit. The brain is one of many different ways of visualizing things. A friend of mine tried to teach me to use Kumu, so Kumu.io, which is really good systems diagramming tool. Like, mm -hmm. you know, if you were trying to model the food system or soil fertility and the food system and health and all that, Kumu would be a really great tool to do that in. I apparently just cannot think in Kumu. I'm extremely interested in how these tools complement each other and what is the suite of tools which if they were more open and more collaborative and more interconnected, and if they were working on shared data, if they could see and improve shared distributed trustworthy data, how would that improve our ability to make good decisions? One of the big lessons from 20 plus years of me using the brain, and I have a thought in my brain called lessons from using the brain. The biggest, most important one is that we are an amnesic civilization, that we are normally pretty smart humans, but we're stupider than we normally would be because we're drowning in the info torrent and we yeah. don't have tools that help us curate what we know and share it out to others and tell meaningful stories with it. This thing over here, you know, the lie that Trump said yesterday, um, we've all agreed is a lie. And the next time he says that lie, we've agreed we're going to leave the room. We don't have that because right. we don't have a place to say we've all agreed this is a lie. And so I think that we as a civilization are stupider and easier to spin. Never mind, we've been treated as mere consumers for, for 50 years instead of as citizens. And that's a whole other thread that I care about a lot because my whole philosophical um, flow that, that ends right now with the word trust starts 25, 30 years ago, about the same time as the brain shows up in my life with the word consumer. So I realized back then when I'm a tech analyst that I hate the word consumer and that by tre being treated as mere consumers, we've been made stupider. If we had better tools for remembering what we know, questioning ourselves, you know, basically iterating on that with each other, alone with each other, uh, together in larger places as part of video storytelling and so forth, we might actually be able to advance our civilization a bit. Thanks for listening to The Adrian Sinclair Show. You can find previous episodes on the A Podcast multi-channel network at apodcast.com. You can also stream this podcast on Spotify, iTunes, Google Podcasts, Podbean, and other audio platforms. And if you subscribe to our weekly newsletter, you'll get convenient short summaries of podcasts you may have missed. So check it out. And lastly, please, please, please support us by sharing our episodes on social media. We really appreciate it. Thanks.